Case Western Reserve University also known as Case Western Reserve, Case Western, Case, and CWRU is a private research university in Cleveland, Ohio. It was created in 1967 through the Federation of Two Long-Standing Contiguous Institutions, Western Reserve University, founded in 1826 and named for its location in the Connecticut Western Reserve, and Case Institute of Technology, founded in 1880 through the endowment of Leonard Case, Jr. Time magazine described the merger as the creation of Cleveland's Big Leaguer University. Seventeen Nobel laureates have been affiliated with Case Western Reserve or one of its two predecessors. In U.S. News & World Report's 2018 rankings, Case Western Reserve was ranked 37th among national universities and 146th among global universities. In 2016, the inaugural edition of the Wall Street Journal – Times Higher Education WSJ, the ranked Case Western Reserve as 32nd among all universities and 29th among private institutions. The campus is approximately 5 miles 8 kilometers east of downtown Cleveland in the neighborhood known as University Circle, an area encompassing 550 acres 220 hectares containing what has been called the greatest concentration of educational, medical, and cultural institutions within one square square mile of the United States. Case Western Reserve has a number of programs taught in conjunction with University Circle institutions, including the Cleveland Clinic, the University Hospitals of Cleveland, the Lewis Stokes Cleveland Department of Veterans Affairs Medical Center, Cleveland Institute of Music, the Cleveland Hearing and Speech Center, the Cleveland Museum of Art, the Cleveland Institute of Art, the Cleveland Museum of Natural History, and the Cleveland Playhouse. Severance Hall, home of the Cleveland Orchestra, resides on Case Western Reserve campus. Case Western Reserve is particularly well known for its medical school, business school, dental school, law school, Francis Payne Bolton School of Nursing named for former U.S. Representative Francis P. Bolton, Department of Biomedical Engineering and its biomedical teaching and research capabilities. Case is also a leading institution for research in electrochemistry and electrochemical engineering. The famous Michelson-Morley interferometer experiment was conducted in 1887 in the basement of a campus dormitory by Albert A. Michelson of Case School of Applied Science and Edward W. Morley of Western Reserve University. Case Western Reserve is a member of the Association of American Universities. History Case Western Reserve University was created in 1967, when Western Reserve University formerly Western Reserve College and Case Institute of Technology formerly Case School of Applied Science, institutions that had been neighbors for 81 years, formally federated. <laughs> Western Reserve University 1826 Western Reserve College, named from the Connecticut Western Reserve, was founded in 1826 in Hudson, Ohio. Western Reserve College, or Reserve, as it was popularly called, was the first college in northern Ohio. Along with Presbyterian influences of its founding, the school's origins were strongly associated with the pre-Civil War abolitionist movement, primarily due to the influence of President Charles Backus Storrs, Eliza Wright, and David Hudson. In fact, Western Reserve was to first university in Ohio and west of the Appalachian Mountains to enroll 1832 and graduate 1836 an African-American student, John Sykes Fayette. The abolitionist views were so strong, Frederick Douglass gave the commencement speech in 1854. In 1838, the Loomis Observatory was built by astronomer Elias Loomis, and today remains the second oldest observatory in the United States. In 1852, the medical school became the second school in the United States to graduate a woman, Nancy Talbot Clark. Five more women graduated over the next four years, including Emily Blackwell, giving Western Reserve the distinction of graduating six of the first eight female physicians in the United States. By 1875, Cleveland had emerged as the dominant population and business center of the region, and the city wanted a prominent higher education institution. In 1882, with funding from Amasa Stone, Western Reserve College moved to Cleveland and changed its name to Adelbert College of Western Reserve University. Adelbert was the name of Stone's son. Topic: <laughs> Case Institute of Technology 1880 to 1967. 
In 1877, Leonard Case Jr. began laying the groundwork for the Case School of Applied Science by secretly donating valuable pieces of Cleveland real estate to a trust. He asked his confidential advisor, Henry Gilbert Abbey, to administer the trust and to keep it secret until after his death in 1880. On March 29, 1880, Articles of Incorporation were filed for the founding of the Case School of Applied Science. Classes began on September 15, 1881. The school received its charter by the state of Ohio in 1882. For the first four years of the school's existence, it was located in the Case family's home on Rockwell Street in downtown Cleveland. Classes were held in the family house, while the chemistry and physics laboratories were on the second floor of the barn. Amasa Stone's gift to relocate Western Reserve College to Cleveland also included a provision for the purchase of land in the University Circle area, adjacent to Western Reserve University, for the Case School of Applied Science. The school relocated to University Circle in 1885. During World War II, Case School of Applied Science was one of 131 colleges and universities nationally that took part in the V-12 Navy College Training Program which offered students a path to a Navy commission. Over time, the Case School of Applied Science grew to encompass a broader vision, adopting the name Case Institute of Technology in 1947 to reflect the institution's growing stature. Federation of two universities Although the trustees of Case Institute of Technology and Western Reserve University did not formally federate their institutions until 1967, the union had been seen by many as inevitable for decades before that. The institutions already shared buildings and staff when necessary and worked together often. One such example was seen in 1887, when case physicist Albert Michelson and reserve chemist Edward Morley collaborated on the famous Michelson-Morley experiment. There had been some discussion of a merger of the two institutions as early as 1890, but those talks dissolved quickly. In the 1920s, the Survey Commission on Higher Education in Cleveland took a strong stand in favor of federation and the community was behind the idea as well, but in the end all that came of the study was a decision by the two institutions to cooperate in founding Cleveland College, a special unit for part-time and adult students in downtown Cleveland. By the 1960s, Reserve President John Schaff Millis and Case President T. Keith Glennon shared the idea that Federation would create a complete university, one better able to attain national distinction. Financed by the Carnegie Corporation, Cleveland Foundation, Greater Cleveland Associated Foundation, and several local donors, a study commission of national leaders in higher education and public policy was charged with exploring the idea of Federation. The Heald Commission, so known for its chair, former Ford Foundation President Henry T. Heald, issued its final report, Vision of a University. The report predicted that Federation would create one of the largest private universities in the nation, with a combined faculty larger than that of Princeton, Chicago, Stanford, or Johns Hopkins. Topic: <laughs> Case Western Reserve University, 1967 present. In 1967, Case Institute of Technology, a school known for its strong engineering and science, and Western Reserve University, a school known for its strong professional programs and liberal arts, came together to form Case Western Reserve University. The first computer engineering program in the United States was established in 1972 at Case Western Reserve University. The forward thinking Campaign was launched in 2011 by President Barbara Snyder to fundraise $1 billion, the largest in school history. The goal was reached in 2014 after 30 months. The Board of Trustees unanimously agreed to expand the campaign to $1.5 billion, which reached its mark a few years later in 2017. Presidents. Topic campus The university is approximately 5 miles 8 kilometers east of downtown Cleveland, adjacent to the historic Wade Park District in University Circle, a park-like city neighborhood and commercial center, home to numerous educational, medical, and other cultural institutions. 
Case Western Reserve has a number of programs taught in conjunction with nearby institutions, including the Cleveland Institute of Music, the Cleveland Institute of Art, the Cleveland Hearing and Speech Center, the Cleveland Museum of Art, the Cleveland Museum of Natural History, the Western Reserve Historical Society, Cleveland Botanical Garden, and the Cleveland Play House. Kent H. Smith Quadrangle The Kent H. Smith Quadrangle known to students as the Main Quad is located south of Euclid between Adelbert Road and Martin Luther King Jr. Drive. All of the engineering buildings are located on this quad in addition to all of the natural science buildings. <laughs> Flora Stone Mather Quadrangle The Flora Stone Mather Quadrangle known to students as the Mather Quad is located north of Euclid Avenue between East Boulevard, E 115th Street, and Juniper Road. Usually it is more strictly defined by the area between East Boulevard, Bellflower Road, and Ford Road north of Euclid Avenue. Named for the philanthropist wife of prominent industrialist Samuel Mather and sister-in-law of the famous statesman John Hay, the Flora Stone Mather Quad is home to Weatherhead School of Management, School of Law, Mandel School of Applied Social Sciences, and many departments of the College of Arts and Sciences, the Kelvin Smith Library Case Western Reserve's main library and the Thwing Student Center are also located on Mather Quad. North Residential Village Situated on the northeast end of campus, the North Residential Village NRV is home to all Case Western Reserve's first-year students and many second-year students residing on campus. Constructed in the 1960s, the NRV consists of 12 four-floor buildings, an 11-floor building, Lutner, a dining hall, and a building containing the NRV area office and rehearsal space for Case Western Reserve's music department. Topic Village at 115 located along E 115th Street, which opened in the fall of 2005. Currently, only upper-class students may reside there. The village as students refer to it, consists of seven houses that surround the football field and track. Village housing is apartment style, with apartments that house one to nine people excluding eight-person units. The apartments are fully furnished. The village is also LEED certified. Houses 1 to 4 and 6 to 7 are certified silver while house 5 is certified gold. Topic: <laughs> South Residential Village. Located between Murray Hill, Cedar, Edgehill, and Overlook Roads, the South Residential Village (SRV) is home to most of Case Western Reserve's sophomore class. SRV is divided into two sections, Murray Hill Complex and Carlton Road Complex known to students as Bottom of the Hill and Top of the Hill, respectively, due to the hill separating the two complexes. Carlton Road Complex includes three sophomore-only dormitories and several Greek life houses. Murray Hill Complex includes four sophomore-only buildings and Fribla, the SRV Dining Hall. It also includes five Greek houses. Topic. Transportation Two main transportation options are available for students, for on and near campus transportation, Case Western Reserve has a fleet of shuttle buses known as Greenies. Case also offers safe transport around campus through the Safe Ride program between 7 p.m. and 3 a.m. For longer trips, students may use the Greater Cleveland Regional Transit Authority RTA bus and rail system. Each undergraduate student receives an unlimited RTA pass, which is paid for via a mandatory $25 fee per semester. The Healthline bus system connects the campus to downtown Cleveland with buses coming roughly every 12 minutes. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Parking. Case Western Reserve does not manage its parking lots standard parking manages the lots and two parking garages, one at the village at 115 lot S46 and the other near the Veal Athletic Center lot S53. Students, faculty, and staff purchase permits from the university. Academics <laughs> <laughs> 
Topic rankings In 2018, Case Western Reserve was ranked 37th in the category American National Universities and 146th in the category Global Universities by U.S. News & World Report. Case Western Reserve was also ranked 32nd among all universities, and 29th among private institutions. In the inaugural edition of the Wall Street Journal Times Higher Education, WSJ, the rankings, in 2014, Washington Monthly ranked Case Western Reserve University as the ninth best national university. In 2013, Washington Monthly ranked Case Western Reserve as the nation's fourth best national university for contributing to the public good. The publication's ranking was based upon a combination of factors including social mobility, research, and service. In 2009, the school had ranked 15th. In 2014, The Times ranked Case Western Reserve 116th worldwide. In September 2009, Businessweek ranked Case Western Reserve's Weatherhead School of Management as one of the 30 best design thinking schools in the world. In 2008, the National Science Foundation ranked Case Western Reserve number 23 in the country for producing the highest percentage of undergraduate students that go on to earn engineering and science PhDs. Case Western Reserve is among the top 25 LGBT-friendly colleges and universities, according to Campus Pride, a national organization that aims to make universities safer and more inclusive for lesbian, gay, bisexual and transgender LGBT individuals. The recognition follows Case Western Reserve's first five-star ranking on the Campus Pride Index, a detailed survey of universities' policies, services and institutional support for LGBT individuals. Case Western Reserve ranks 13th among private institutions 26th among all in federal expenditures for science and engineering research and development, per the National Science Foundation. Undergraduate profile The six most popular majors highly ranked for graduates were Biomedical Engineering, Biology, Biological Sciences, Social Work, Nursing, Mechanical Engineering, and Psychology. CWRU's undergraduate community is particularly well known for having a heavy focus on the fields of medicine and engineering. The class of 2020 had 79% of students from out of the state of Ohio, 16% from outside of the United States. 71% graduated in the top 10% of their high school class. The mid-50% for SAT scores 25% to 75% were between 1310 and 1470. The mid-50% for ACT scores was 30 to 34 superscored. Case Western has an acceptance rate of 29% for the class of 2022. Topic. Schools and programs The university in its present form consists of eight schools College of Arts and Sciences 1826, School of Dental Medicine 1892, Case School of Engineering 1880, School of Law 1892, Weatherhead School of Management 1952, School of Medicine University program 1843 College program at Cleveland Clinic 2002 Francis Payne Bolton School of Nursing 1898 Mandel School of Applied Social Sciences 1915 Case also supports over a hundred centers in various fields Topic <laughs> Sears Think Box Larry Sears and Sally Zalotnik Sears Think Box is a public access design and innovation center at Case Western Reserve University that allows students and other users to access prototyping equipment and other invention resources. The makerspace is located in the Ritchie Mixon Building, a seven-story, 50,000 sq feet, facility behind the Campus Athletic Center. Over $35 million has been invested in space including in large part from a funding of $10 million from alumni Larry Sears and his wife Sally Zalotnik Sears. Larry Sears is an adjunct faculty member in the Department of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science at CWRU and the founder of Hexagram, Inc. now Eclara Wireless Technologies. Many projects and startup companies have come out of the makerspace. Topic. Naming controversy 
In 2003, the university unveiled a new logo and branding campaign that emphasized the case portion of its name. In 2006, interim university president Gregory Eastwood convened a task group to study reactions to the campaign. The panel's report indicated that it had gone so poorly that there appear to be serious concerns now about the university's ability to recruit and maintain high-quality faculty, fundraising and leadership. Also, the logo was derided among the university's community and alumni and throughout northeastern Ohio, critics said it looked like a fat man with a surfboard. In 2007, the university's board of trustees approved a shift back to giving equal weight to Case and Western Reserve. A new logo was chosen and implementation began July 1. In an open letter to the university community, interim president Eastwood admitted that the university had misplaced its own history and traditions. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Student body. As of 2018, the university had 5,121 undergraduate students and 6,219 graduate and professional students. The undergraduate student body hails from all 50 states and over 100 countries. Research Following is a partial list of major contributions made by faculty, staff, and students at Case Western Reserve. Case Western Reserve was the site of the famous Michelson-Morley interferometer experiment, conducted in 1887 by Albert A. Michelson of Case Institute of Technology and Edward W. Morley of Western Reserve University. This experiment proved the non-existence of the ether, and provided evidence that later substantiated Einstein's special theory of relativity. Albert A. Michelson, who became the first American to win a Nobel Prize in Science, taught at Case Institute of Technology. He won the prize in physics in 1907. Edward W. Morley, in 1895, made the most precise to that date determination of the atomic weight of oxygen, the basis for calculating the weights of all other elements. Dayton C. Miller, in 1896, performed the first full X-ray of the human body—on himself. George W. Kreil, in 1905, performed the first modern blood transfusion, using a coupling device to connect blood vessels. Roger G. Perkins, in 1912, pioneered drinking water chlorination to eradicate typhoid bacilli. Henry J. Gersenberger, in 1915, developed simulated infant formula. Claude S. Beck, in 1935, pioneered surgical treatment of coronary artery disease. Frederick S. Cross, in the 1950s, developed the first heart-lung machine used during open-heart surgery. Claude S. Beck, in 1947, performed the first successful life-saving defibrillation of the human heart and developed cardiopulmonary resuscitation CPR. Robert Kearns, in 1964, invented the intermittent windshield wiper used in most modern automobiles. Frederick Rhinus, in 1965, first detected neutrinos created by cosmic ray collisions with the Earth's atmosphere and developed innovative particle detectors. Case Western Reserve had selected Professor. Rhinus as chair of the physics department based on Rhinus's work that first detected neutrinos emitted from a nuclear reactor—work for which Rhinus shared a 1995 Nobel Prize. Eric Baer, in 1967, pioneered the materials science of polymers and created the first comprehensive polymer science and engineering department at a major U.S. university. Joseph F. Fagan, in 1987, developed a test for infants to identify mental retardation within one year of birth. Huntington F. Willard of the School of Medicine and University Hospitals of Cleveland — collaborating with colleagues at Atherses, Inc., in 1997 — created the first artificial human chromosomes, opening the door to more detailed study of human genetics and potentially offering a new approach to gene therapy. Shaliji Marwala, in 2006, began work on local loop unbundling in Africa. He also chaired the Local Loop Unbundling Committee on behalf of the South African government. Furthermore, Marwala and his collaborators developed an artificial larynx, developed the theory of rational counterfactuals, computer bluffing as well as establishing the relationship between artificial intelligence and the theory of information asymmetry. 
Roger Quinn, in 2001, developed robots such as WEGS that mimic cockroaches and other crawling insects Case Biorobotics Lab. In 2007, a team from Case Western Reserve participated in the DARPA Urban Challenge with a robotic car named Dexter. Team Case placed as one of 36 semifinalists. Dexter was the only car in the race without any seating for humans, and the only one built from scratch as a robot car. Case Western Reserve University researchers are developing atomically thin drumheads which is tens of trillions times smaller in volume and 100,000 times thinner than the human eardrum. They will be able to receive and transmit signals across a radio frequency range which will be far greater than what we can hear with the human ear. Today, the university operates several facilities off campus for scientific research. One notable example of this is the Warner and Swazi Observatory at Kitt Peak National Observatory in Arizona. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Student life. A campus shuttle runs to Coventry Village, a shopping district in neighboring Cleveland Heights. Cleveland's Little Italy is within walking distance. Legacy Village, Severance Center, and Shaker Square shopping centers are all within driving distance or accessible by RTA. Music <laughs> 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 WRUWFM 91.1 FM is the campus radio station of Case Western Reserve University. Its motto, "More music, fewer hits," can be seen adorning the rear bumpers of many vehicles in the area. WRUW broadcasts at a power of 15,000 watts and covers most of Northeast Ohio 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. WRUW is staffed by Case Western Reserve students and community volunteers. The station's format can be classified as non-commercial variety. Case Western Reserve is also home to several performing ensembles, including a cappella groups such as Democapella, the Case Men's Glee Club, Case Women's Glee Club, Case in Point, Speakeasy, Bigger Than a Breadbox, and Solstice. Other ensembles include the Case – University Circle Symphony Orchestra, Camerata Chamber Orchestra, Case – CIM Baroque Orchestra, Concert Choir, Early Music Singers, Jazz Ensemble 1 and 2, Marching Spartans, Percussion Ensemble, Symphonic Winds, University Singers, Collegium Musicum, New Music Ensemble, Wind Ensemble, and Chamber Music. Case Western Reserve has two main rehearsal spaces for performing arts music majors and school ensembles. Hayden Hall contains practice rooms with Steinway pianos, along with the department offices. Denison Hall serves as a rehearsal, practice, and teaching space for the music students and school ensembles, and is attached to Wade Commons. The Cleveland Youth Wind Symphony also rehearses in Denison Hall. Music majors take lessons at the Cleveland Institute of Music. For performances, all students, ensembles, and capella groups use Harkness Chapel. The bands and orchestra also perform at Severance Hall, the on-campus home of the Cleveland Orchestra, and CIM's Kula's Hall. Topic Computing Case Western Reserve had the first ABET accredited program in computer engineering. In 1968, the university formed a private company, Kai Corporation, to provide computer time to both it and other customers. Initially this was on a Univac 1108 replacing the preceding Univac 1107, 36-bit, one's complement machine. The company was sold in 1977 to Robert G. Benson in Beechwood, Ohio. Project Logos, under ARPA contract, was begun within the department on a DEC System 10 later converted to Tenix BBN in conjunction with connection to the ARPANET to develop a computer-aided computer design system. This system consisted in a distributed, networked, graphics environment, a control and data flow designer and logic both hardware and software analyzer. Graphics and animation became another departmental focus with the acquisition of an Evans & Sutherland LDS-1 line drawing system 1, which was hosted by the DEC System 10, and later with the acquisition of the standalone LDS-2. Case Western Reserve was one of the earliest universities connected to the ARPANET, predecessor to the Internet. ARPANET went online in 1969, Case Western Reserve was connected in January, 1971. Case Western Reserve graduate Ken Biba published the Biba Integrity Model in 1977 and served on the ARPA Working Group that developed the Transmission Control Protocol used on the Internet. 
Case Western Reserve pioneered the early free net computer systems, creating the first free net, the Cleveland Free Net, as well as writing the software that drove a majority of those systems, known as Freeport. The Cleveland Free Net was shut down in late 1999, as it had become obsolete. It was the first university to have an all fiber optic network. In 1989, at the inaugural meeting in October, 1996, Case Western Reserve was one of the 34 charter university members of Internet 2. The university was ranked number one in Yahoo Internet Life's 1999 Most Wired College list. There was a perception that this award was obtained through partially false or inaccurate information submitted for the survey, and the university did not appear at all on the 2000 Most Wired College list which included 100 institutions. The numbers reported were much lower than those submitted by Ray Neff in 1999. The university had previously placed number 13 in the 1997 poll. In August 2003, Case Western Reserve joined the Internet Streaming Media Alliance, then one of only two university members. In September 2003, Case Western Reserve opened 1,230 public wireless access points on the Case Western Reserve campus and University Circle. Case Western Reserve was one of the founding members of One Cleveland, formed in October 2003. One Cleveland is an ultra broadband gigabit speed fiber optic network. This network is for the use of organizations in education, research, government, healthcare, arts, culture, and the nonprofit sector in Greater Cleveland. Case Western Reserve is also known for its Virtual Worlds Gaming Computer Lab, which opened in 2005. The lab has a large network of Alienware PCs equipped with game development software such as the Torque Game Engine and Maya 3D modeling software. Additionally, it contains a number of specialized advanced computing rooms including a medical simulation room, a MIDI instrument music room, a 3D projection immersion room, a virtual reality research room, and console room, which features video game systems such as Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, and Wii. This laboratory can be used by any student in the Electrical Engineering and Computer Science Department, and is heavily used for the Game Development course. Case Western's Internet Technology Service also runs a high-performance computing cluster HPCC, utilizing 2,684 processors over 200 computer nodes interconnected with gigabit fiber optic Ethernet. The HPCC is available for research utilizing a wide array of commercial and custom scientific software packages and computer languages including, MATLAB, Mathematica, ANSYS CFX Fluent and ICEM, Schrodinger, LAMMPS, Gaussian, Neuron, Mikkel, Python, Q-Hull, Sundials, Charm, Q-Chem, Rosetta, Gromax, NAMD, C, C++, Fortran. Housing Residence halls are divided into two areas, one featuring suite-style rooms for second-year students in the South Residential Village, the other featuring double, single and suite-style rooms for first-year students and upperclassmen in the North Residential Village. Both have gigabit Ethernet network access and the wired network is one of the fastest that exists. A wireless campus network is also available in all buildings on campus and ranked as one of the fastest by Intel in 2005. Suite-style housing, known as the Village at 115th, was opened in fall 2005 for upperclassmen and features one-to-nine person, apartment-style, residence halls that come with air conditioning, a full kitchen area, and full-sized beds. Residence life at Case Western Reserve has a recent history of being liberal in its policies, including allowing co-ed suites an option offered to non-freshman students, when requested and agreed upon by all occupants of a suite and several co-ed floors for freshmen, as well as a three-day guest policy. Pets are allowed except for dogs, cats, ferrets, and a few other small mammals, but requests are granted discussion. First-year students are grouped into one of four residential colleges that are overseen by first-year coordinators. The Mistletoe, Juniper, and Magnolia residential colleges were established when the first-year experience system was introduced, and Cedar was created in the fall of 2005 to accommodate a large influx of new students. In the fall of 2007, Magnolia was integrated into Mistletoe, however, it was later re-separated in the fall of 2012. The areas of focus for each college are, Cedar, Visual and Performing Arts, Mistletoe, Service Leadership, Juniper, Multiculturalism and Magnolia, Sustainability. 
Magnolia now includes Clark Tower, which also houses second-year students as well as first-year students. The residential colleges plan events together and are run by college councils that take student input and use it to plan social and community service-oriented activities. Third-year students who are allowed to live off-campus through graduate students have several university-owned, university-controlled, and independent apartment options. Greek life Nearly one half of the campus undergraduates are in a fraternity or sorority. There are ten sororities and seventeen fraternities currently on campus. Greek organizations are governed by an interfraternity council and Panhellenic council. During the 2010–2011 school year, fraternities and sororities at CASE collectively raised over $45,375 for philanthropy. In September 2010, the Delta Chi fraternity joined the Greek community, achieving chapter status in October 2012. In September 2012, Pi Beta Phi sorority began a colonization effort. In the spring of 2013, Delta Sigma Phi fraternity began colonization efforts as well. In the spring of 2014, a colony of Pi Kappa Phi was opened. In the 2014-2015 academic year a chapter of the sorority Sigma 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 joined the campus along with the return of the fraternity Sigma Alpha Epsilon. In spring of 2018, Alpha Gamma Delta will colonize as well. The fraternities are The sororities are Topic. Safety and security Topic. Office of Emergency Management The Office of Emergency Management prepares for various levels of emergencies on campus, such as chemical spills, severe weather, infectious diseases, and security threats. RAVE, a multi-platform emergency alerting system, is operated by Emergency Management for issuing emergency alerts and instructions for events on campus. The Office of Emergency Management also performs risk assessment to identify possible safety issues and aims to mitigate these issues. Additionally, CERT is managed through emergency management, enabling faculty and staff members to engage in emergency preparedness. The Office of Emergency Management works closely with other campus departments, such as Police and Security Services, University Health Services, and Environmental Health and Safety, as well as community resources including city, state, and federal emergency management agencies. <laughs> Police and Security Services CASE operates a police force of sworn officers as well as a security officers. Starting as security only, the university expanded the role of protective services to include sworn officers who have arrest power and carry firearms. Some officers have additional training, such as SWAT training. On top of routine duties such as fingerprinting, traffic control, and bicycle registration, police and security also conduct investigations, undercover operations, and community outreach. Police and security operate a fleet of vehicles, including police cruisers, scooters, and smart cars. Police and security are dispatched by a 24-7 campus dispatch center, responsible for emergency call handling, alarm monitoring, and video surveillance. Additionally, the dispatch center can send rave notifications and manages CWRU Shield, a mobile application allowing video, image, and text tips, safety checks, and viewing emergency procedures. CWRU Police also works closely with RTA Transit Police, University Circle Police, Cleveland Police, East Cleveland Police, Cleveland Heights Police, University Hospitals Police Department, and other surrounding emergency services. Police and security, with conjunction with the Emergency Management Office, conduct tabletop drills and full-scale exercises involving surrounding emergency services. Emergency medical services Case Western Reserve University Emergency Medical Services is a student-run all-volunteer ambulance service and a National Collegiate Emergency Medical Services Foundation member. 
Covering University Circle, CWRUMS provides free basic life support level treatment and transport to University Hospitals Case Medical Center and Cleveland Clinic Foundation Main Campus. CWRUMS started as a quick response service but has since become a transport service with two ambulances. Crews consist of at least at least two Ohio EMTs and receive medical direction from University Hospitals. CWRU works closely with the Office of Emergency Management and Police and Security Services. CWRUMS is in service 5 p.m. to 8 a.m. Monday through Thursday and all day Friday through Sunday. When not in service, members are dispatched to emergencies through the active 911 application. When not in service or when additional resources are required, Cleveland EMS, Cleveland Fire, or Cleveland Heights Fire can be called. Additionally, CWRUMS runs a semesterly EMT certification class through University Hospitals EMS Institute. In the past, the organization has planned and executed an annual full-scale mass casualty incident drill where other campus and public agencies participated in simulated patient treatment and incident command. However, public safety regulation changes in the summer of 2018 have prohibited any organizations other than the Office of Public Safety from performing drills on the campus. Topic: Traditions. Starting in 1910, the Hudson Relay is an annual relay race event remembering and honoring the university relocation from Hudson, Ohio to Cleveland. Conceived by then-student, Monroe Curtis, the relay race was run from the old college in Hudson, Ohio to the new university in University Circle. Since the mid-1980s, the race has been run entirely in the University Circle area. The race is a distance of 26 miles 42 kilometers. It is held weekend before spring semester finals. Competing running teams are divided by graduating class. If a class wins the relay all four years, tradition dictates a reward of a champagne and steak dinner with the president of the university be awarded. Only six classes have won all four years—1982, 1990, 1994, 2006, 2011, and 2017. The winning classes of each year is carved on an original boulder located behind a Delbert Hall. Springfest is a day-long concert and student group festival that occurs later in the same day as Hudson Relays. The Springfest planning committee brings in several bands and a beer garden, student groups set up booths to entertain the student body, and various inflatable carnival-style attractions are brought in to add to the festive atmosphere. Occasionally, due to adverse weather conditions, the festival must be moved indoors, usually to Thwing Center or a Delbert Gym. Halloween at the Farm is a tradition established in the fall of 2002. Halloween at the Farm takes place at the Squire Valleyview Farm in Hunting Valley, Ohio. Students, their families, and faculty are invited to enjoy games, a bonfire, an open-air concert and hay rides. Organized by the members of the Class Officer Collective, HATF is one of the biggest events of the year. In the fall of 2009 the event was moved to the main campus and renamed Halloween at Home. Since 1976, the Film Society of Case Western Reserve University has held a science fiction marathon. The film festival, the oldest of its type, boasts more than 34 hours of non-stop movies, cartoons, trailers, and shorts spanning many decades and subgenres, using both film and digital projection. The Film Society, which is student-run and open to the public, also shows movies on Friday and Saturday evenings throughout the school year. Athletics Case Western Reserve competes in 19 varsity sports—10 men's sports and 9 women's sports. All 19 varsity teams wear a commemorative patch on their uniforms honoring Case alumnus, M. Frank Rudy, inventor of the Nike Air Sole. The Spartans' primary athletic rival is Carnegie Mellon University. DeSanto Field is home to the football, men's soccer, women's soccer, and track and field teams. Case Western Reserve is a founding and current member of the University Athletic Association UAA. The conference participates in the National Collegiate Athletic Associations NCAA Division III. Case Institute of Technology and Western Reserve University were also a founding members of the President's Athletic Conference PAC in 1958. 
When the athletic departments of the two universities merged in 1971 they dominated the PAC for several years. The university remained a member of the PAC until 1983. In the fall of 1984 the university joined the North Coast Athletic Conference NCAC, a pioneer in gender equality in sports, as a charter member. The 1998–1999 school year marked the final season in which the Spartans were members of the NCAC. As the university had held joint conference membership affiliation with the UAA and the NCAC for over a decade. In 2014, the football team began competing as an associate member of the PAC, as only four out of the eight UAA member institutions remained in the conference. The university offers ten men's sports and nine women's sports. In recent years, the Case Western Reserve baseball team has made appearances in the NCAA postseason. In 2014, the Spartans advanced to the NCAA Mid-East Regional Final before losing to Salisbury State 3-2. The 2014 team set a school record for victories in a season with 34, and also won a UAA title. In 2011, Spartan third baseman Chad Mullins was named the D3Baseball.com Player of the Year after hitting .437 with 8 home runs and 71 RBIs. Mullins also ranked in the Division III National Top 10 in hits, runs scored, and total bases. Case Western Reserve has a long and historied cross-country program. The Case Western Reserve's women's cross-country team finished the 2006 season with a UAA championship and a bid to the NCAA championship. The Lady Spartans finished 10th in the nation. The women's team went on to finish even higher at Nationals in 2007, earning a sixth-place finish at the NCAA DIII National Championship. Both the men's and women's cross-country teams qualified for and competed in the NCAA DIII National Championships in 2008, with the women's team coming away with two All-Americans and a 16th-place finish. In 2009, they had two All-Americans and finished 15th. In 2010, the Lady Spartans finished 19th, with one All-American. From 2006 to 2010 the women's cross-country team earned eight individual All-American titles, including current professional marathoner Esther Erb. The Case Western Reserve football team re-emerged in the mid-2000s under the direction of head coach Greg DeBeljak. The 2007 team finished undefeated earning the school's first playoff appearance and first playoff victory, winning against Whittinger University. The undefeated seasons continued in both 2008 and 2009, earning more UAA titles and NCAA Division III playoff appearances, helping set up an all-time school record of a 38-game regular season win streak. In 2017, the Spartans again went undefeated and advanced to the NCAA Division III playoffs, defeating Illinois Wesleyan University in the first round, before being eliminated in the second round by the Mount Union Purple Raiders, the eventual NCAA Division III national champion. In total, the team has won eight UAA football championships 1988, 1996, 2007, 2008, 2009, 2011, 2016, and 2017. In 2014, the football team began competing as an associate member of the President's Athletic Conference, winning the conference in 2017. All other sports continue to compete in the University Athletic Association. The Case Western Reserve men's soccer team finished their 2006 season with a 2 February 17 record and a UAA championship. The team reached the Sweet 16 in their first ever NCAA Division III tournament appearance and concluded the season ranked 12th in the nation. In 2018, the Case Western Reserve men's soccer team made their deepest NCAA run ever, advancing to the NCAA Division III Elite Eight, before falling in the quarterfinals to Calvin College, 3-1. The 2018 team finished the season with a record of 2 April 16. In 2014, the Spartan men's tennis team was ranked in the Division III Top 10 for most of the season, and advanced to the NCAA Elite Eight before falling to Middlebury College. That same year, two CWRU tennis players, Eric Clauder and Christopher Krimble, won the NCAA men's doubles title. CWRU has produced eight individual Division III national champions in indoor and outdoor track and field. The Case Western Reserve Ultimate Frisbee team, although a club sport, competes against Division I teams around the country. Established in 1995, the Fighting Gobies have been successful, with the men's team taking home first place in the Ohio Valley Regional Tournament. 
CWRU wrestlers have won four individual division three national titles. Notable people Notable alumni include Paul Buckheit, creator and lead developer of Gmail, founder of Friendfeed, and partner at Y Combinator, Craig Newmark, founder of Craigslist.org, Pete Kumin, the co-founder and CTO of Optimizely, and Peter Tippett, who developed the antivirus software Vaccine, which Symantec purchased and turned into the popular Norton antivirus, Larry Hurtado, one of the leading New Testament scholars in the world, Harvey Hilbert, a Zen master, psychologist and expert on post-Vietnam stress syndrome. Nobel laureates Alumni associations Throughout the years, many higher education institutions merged to form what is now known as Case Western Reserve University. The Alumni Association of Case Western Reserve University is the primary alumni association for any alumni who have attended CWRU for at least one semester. The Case Alumni Association (CAA) is one of the oldest independent alumni organization in the United States, having been organized in 1885. Membership in the association is conferred upon all graduates of the Case School of Applied Science, Case Institute of Technology, Case School of Engineering, and the Mathematics and Science Departments within the College of Arts and Sciences. CAA recently expanded its reach by establishing chapters case clubs in various U.S. cities, including Washington, D.C., Silicon Valley, San Diego, Los Angeles, Phoenix and Boston. Topic. Cultural references The 1997 Air Force One was in part filmed on Case campus. The opening scene depicting the presidential palace of the leader of Kazakhstan was shot at Severance Hall, home of the Cleveland Orchestra adjacent to Case campus. Also seen are several landmarks of Case including the Thwing Center the Student Union and the Allen Memorial Medical Library. The 2004 vice presidential debate between then Vice President Dick Cheney and Senator John Edwards was held on Case Western Campus. In 2008, the movie Flash of Genius detailed the story of Robert Kearns, who graduated from Case Institute of Technology. The movie recounts his designing the first intermittent windshield wipers and his battle against the automobile industry to get recognition. See also Association of Independent Technological Universities <laughs>